Hey, what's up guys? Ruby here. Um, there's a bit of surprise for us today. Well, not really surprise if you've been keeping tabs on um, news in regards to major orders in Helldivers 2. And so if you uh, watched, if you had watched my video of yesterday or paid attention to what's been going on the past couple of days, you noticed, um, you'll know that there was a uh, major order to liberate Taekwon in regards to the factories that are being assaulted by automatons. And so uh, we were able to liberate the coin. Liberty and now, if you go to, closer. you log into the game, you the go to your Galactic the Galaxy table. remains in jeopardy. If you Let tap on uh, left trigger, I'm playing with a controller on my PC. Um, it says here that well done, Hell Divers. Tain Kwan has been returned to the care of managed democracy. The Morganson Arsenal and its stockpile of freshly produced exosuits are recovered intact. The Exo 45 Patriot Exosuit is now available for requisition. What that means is that um, we now have access to mechs in the game. And so if I go back, if you go back here, and you go to this section of your ship, we're in uh, under ship management, go to stratagems. If you um, go down to, let's see, where's the section again? The section for engineering bay, if I'm not mistaken. No, actually not. Robotics workshop is what it is. You notice that it has the um, Patriot Exosuit there. Now this is the this is one of the Exosuits um, for the game. This is the one that has the Gatling gun and rocket pods on it, and it's it's pretty it's really good. And so it's a purchase price of um, twenty thousand um, credits. And so if you have 20,000 credits um, on your Helldivers account, you can purchase it. And if I'm also not mistaken, you have to be at least level 25 to be able to unlock this. Now, um, the servers right now are kind of wonky. I thought they'd fi they had fixed this shit, but it appears that they still haven't fixed the stuff. It's been, what, almost a month into the game and they're still having server-related issues. But I can't purchase this, so... Um, I'm guessing after a while servers are gonna stabilize once they get their shit under order. But that's about it really though. I'm um, all to be aware it might take a while to get into the game when you're trying to log in today. It took um, about 10 or so minutes for me to log into the game. My only, the game is so good, but my only qualms is that this is a live service game. They need to get their servers on the handle. Um, players are only gonna have good for so long. When it's still a month, it's about a month now into the game and it's still having several little issues. Like, I'm even getting ticked off, beginning to get ticked off myself. But anyways, that's it though. Um, that's Max in Helldivers 2. And frankly, if they don't get their shit in order in regards to their servers, I'm just gonna move on to a different game. I don't have time for this nonsense. Uh, my goodwill in regards to them and making excuses for them or being able to take excuses that I play is make for them can only far um if they're not aware they're slowly killing their player base so i have friends who refuse to play this game anymore because of continuous server issues it's a lot better now compared to before but it's a, about a month into the game i used to having this yeah. um devs if you're watching this i know you probably aren't and i don't care <laughs> just get the shit on the order please thanks Anyways, um, that's Roby here, showing you guys the mechs I'm in the game now, and my little rant in regards to ongoing server issues. A month into the game for a live service game that you cannot play offline, a game you purchased that you cannot play offline. Uh, where if you're trying to play in the free time you have, you might run into issues where you cannot play the game that you paid for. Anyway, that's it though. Uh, with that, Roby out. Peace.